What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Bald Man React. Finally getting back into some Gazette and the track Taeyeon, originally requested by Daira and subsequently requested by many others out there in subscriber land. Now, I love Gazette. If you've been following the channel for a while, you'll know that they're probably one of my favorite Japanese bands that do tracks on. I love their sound. I love the vocals. I think they're a really enjoyable band. So I'm looking forward to this one, as I always look forward to the Gazette track. The band is the Gazette, the track is Taeyeon, and here we go. <laughs> I like that riff. Big bass line. Building well. Get some of that 90s alternative influence here. Like that interesting guitar melody floating around back there. So you can hear him sing in English more. You enjoy it. I like those interesting guitar lines. It's got a jarring riff, but a nice groove to it. Such a great groove. This is almost danceable. I like how groovy and simple that riff is. That transition for me was a touch awkward, but I like it. I like where it went. I like that vocal on there a lot. Love how good that riff is. Really do. Almost reminds me a touch of Nirvana, to be honest. Boy, that's shifted. A little guitar things going on there. It's interesting that they went with this style of a groove for the chorus. And the way that verse ends, picture a bit different groove for it. One, two, one that would flow a little easier. It's still good. It's just not what I expect to come out for it to come into that path.
Though I do like the fact that it's not for Hickey. I like that bass on under there. Get a harmony riff. I think that riff is probably my favorite part of this song. It's such a good, strong riff. A little bit of feedback back there. All right, that was the Gazette and Taeyeon. I dig it. B, there's an interesting change from the verse to the chorus. You, I expect a groove there. But I guess I'm not sure how to explain it. I expect a different style of groove, more of a rolling riff as opposed to that very polyrhythmic and palm muted riff that they go with. So that's, a, that's a, a pleasant surprise. And then the transition originally into that cleaner passage, I, at first, the first listen, first time it came around, I felt that it was a touch jarring because they didn't really punctuate it or lead it in with the fill. But the second time hearing it, I did really like it. I enjoy the track. It's certainly not one of my favorites that I've heard from them, but it certainly is enjoyable. Love the vocals, but then again, I've always enjoyed Ruby's voice. I think the little guitar harmonies they do are outstanding. And I think it's a good track. It's certainly one that I'll go back to but it just ha it's not it's not gonna cra scratch that top five so far. So there's pretty stiff competition there, but enjoyable nonetheless. That's for sure. Thank you all for the request for it. I'm sorry it's been a week since I've done some because I do need to get back to more. But there are so many things on this list right now. It is nuts. It is awesome. It is wonderful. But. There are certain bands I just don't get a chance to get back to you as much as I want to at the moment. Thank you all for being here. Thank you all so much for the support. I love you and I appreciate you. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Thank you to my law enforcement, military veterans, and first responders for what you do every day. Hope you're doing well wherever you happen to be in or around the globe out there. As always, you have been awesome. I have been bald, man. I will see you in the next one. Be excellent to each other. And keep headbanging.